also peer to nandamana we're still adding value to what is going on um uh, back at home uh please go ahead the next speaker nafikiri ilikuwa six mini mekasirika and uh, there is somebody who's written to my dm and i to awazi and he has said bro how is this guy telling people to limit to two minutes and he's talking for a whole damn hour honestly speaking nilimekuwa na watch game ya france na spain ikianza iko dakika 43 you guys are not serious we are not here to listen to one fucking person all that time that is not what you are out here for secondly i've been going through my tl leo na mtu anasema mnaongea hizo spaces ikifika wakati wa maandamano hakuna mali hakuna kisi mtu anatokea guys you are all frauds i'm not happy muinue mkono wa watu wanaongea huku kifu mmetokea maandamano and you are in kenya you are not coming out to those streets we can be talking here having conversations daily yet somebody is wearing a watch worth 900k we want to create leaders yet nobody wants to fight to remove the ones that are here i've kept on mentioning here our problem is recycling look what a, an, a 79 year old is going to say in front of people oh we need to have dialogue he doesn't know what the country wants and we still want those people omolo nobody is going to disintegrate us come 2027 I'll put it and I said if it means tweeting with my account from today up to 2027 I will until people know that we don't want this set of leaders that are there they must all go home what we want is good governance Mimi siko hapa I I get more than 100 DMs daily nitumie cabbage nitumie cabbage is that what i want people to be telling here me here on twitter no nataka hata mimi nipigie mavin ni mwambie mavo uko wapi twende tukule nyama pale kamaki tukimaliza tuingie kentu the address pale tupige drink matel to the home to those honestly speaking we are speaking here and i'm very mad because By the time you are seeing these leaders uniting right now tunafaa tukua hata kesho tumepanga huyo murko men mwenye alisema amevaa saa 900k occupy his office tomorrow let him know the wrath of people and let them know we ni sisi tumewa employ si wao wametu employ ni sisi tumewa employ we are paying them with our taxes guys especially people who are in Kenya and i said it there is nobody who is work you can't be work and you are earning 50000 you are earning 100000 in somebody's office and you say you are earning money that is damn small money go out protest for a better future we want people to be paid good salaries We want good working environments. We want good roads, good drainage system. Have you walked in Nairobi? Personally, there is no street in Nairobi I don't know. Start from Koja, twende hadi OTC, Kamukunji. There is no place I haven't passed to because I worked in that city. There is a place always Peter Nairobi town kama una au Java mask because you'll suffocate. We are here we are leaving these leaders to keep carrying us shit. Ruto is strategizing daily, making breaking us daily, breaking us daily. But you are here coming to speak on spaces and you are not going out there on those streets. Let us whatever we say here is whatever we should be doing. Actions speak louder than words. And I said here there is no single day mimi nimekosa maandamano hata ya Sunday nilikuwa. I left town at 10 p.m. on Sunday. So it has reached a point where as much as we are having conversations on these spaces we should be out there fighting for our country. Murkomen has found confidence all of a sudden. Anatuwekea tu kumi kwa siku. Kiture Kindiki is speaking nonsense and we are letting these people stay in those offices. Na Humicha is saying also bullshit that these people have come here because they have been paid. 
na tunamwacha akae kwa hiyo ofisi why right now is the time william ruto should know after reject finance bill we don't want his cabinet we are this, this country is not a set of place where we will be rewarding loyalty every day you cannot keep rewarding your friend a, a thief you cannot keep covering for a thief daily because he's a bro, your brother one day he will come and steal your cow and you will feel that pain and that is what we are saying we are seeing right now we voted ruto kama mtu wetu right now anatuibia sisi wenyewe so guys start wacha william ruto ajue saa hizi we don't want his cabinet ibc tick tushamaliza hapo what is next we don't want his cabinet that is what we should be pushing from monday to friday and we don't want them so guys it is time for actions and let us act thank you very very uh, may I speak now kindly yeah uh, co-host so on the heels of six i want to say it's true actually i'm on whatsapp i'm leading a couple of groups i was leading some om chantings and i mentioned that in one of the spaces and it's funny how we will do it when we are in the comfort of our houses but when it comes to going to the streets and i always used to ask nani anaenda so that we we meet up and nobody used to respond and this is like four groups four groups with over 100 to 400 people so it's true and the other funny thing is how everyone in the dm is always telling me what you will you will get um hurt and everything but i always ask them if uh, what makes the people who are going on the streets their lives more special than ours so i actually 100% second six i was so agitated when i don't know one of the mandamanos people just didn't come out yet the previous night everyone was saying how they would go to the streets okay that i digress it's not what i was coming to say but i second him then the second thing is i wanted to reemphasize what i was saying about mainstream the news out here let me paint for you guys a picture i went to the market on monday and i was talking to this mama mboga and she was complaining about her son who was actually shot on the foot and i was now just saying oh mna support nini nini and then he's like no me me from the bottom of my heart i support ruto i don't even know why i love ruto so much but i do my son on the other hand alikuwa tu hapa sijui nani alimtuma aende huko maandamano it's not like the country belongs to him and i was just shook guys i'm like are you seriously talking about your son like that she's like yeah I, he's just there i've left him I and I'm blaming him for having done that. Then I turned to the other guys and they were all um saying the same thing. Sisi tumezoea kukumia like it's okay it doesn't really matter what happens we don't support you guys. And I spoke to a couple of other people not related just different people on a different line. So I just said this to communicate the same message I said before. People on the ground who are the majority are not with us. The, 